actually, uh, with our panelists from uh, Mothers for Black Lives. Uh, we did uh, tell a little bit about your platform, but we would like you all to start the discussion. Great. Thank you. Um, I know everyone here today has seen the reactions across our country and all over the world in regards to the recent events involving the murder of George Floyd. Some refer to this death as an act of police brutality. Some call it lethal force. Some only see racism. In the end, no matter the terminology used to refer to this event, a black man was killed at the hands of someone in power and authority. This is what the outrage is about. A community that is tired, scared, and angry. Anger is one of the five stages of grief. The media fails to mention that, and instead highlights behavior that continues to feed personal biases and stereotypes about a community that is hurting. If someone actually addressed the grief the black community has experienced as a result of generational trauma, perhaps they could empathize with people that have suffered fear and sorrow perpetuated by constant acts of racism, injustice, and violence. As a member of the Kyle Buda community, I empathize with my black brothers and sisters and wanted to show my solidarity. I also wanted to express to my friends and family that I valued their lives and want them to feel safe in this community. One way for me to do that was to be verbal about my stance against racism and injustice. Another way was to show my support to the Black Lives Movement. So I organized the first peaceful protest in Kyle and encouraged others to support like myself, as mothers summoned by George Floyd's last words calling for his own mother. This is how the Mothers for Black Lives group was created. The group was formed to show support and solidarity to the black community. Our goal, as Mr. Dex already mentioned, is to promote reform in local police policies, raise awareness against systemic racism and injustice, and create a safe space of peace, love, unity, and respect for people of all ethnic backgrounds in the Kyle Buda area.